Hello, hello. Welcome back to our channel. Oh. We're, yeah, hanging in the great outdoors. It's a beautiful day outside here in Norway. It's actually summertime, but we've got some winter clothes on because here in Norway, you never know what the weather's gonna do. It's been a bit all four seasons today. Not snow though, but yeah. Yeah, be out here. I got my shoes off, grounding my feet. Yep we live on the fifth floor in know? the nice grass yeah, yeah i don't think nice. i can turn the i don't know how to do this but yeah. Yeah. yeah anyways so we wanted to hop on here and talk to you about the thing that keeps perpetuating separation in between twin flames it's the one thing that fuels separation and it's the one thing that you need to um transcend let it go let it go in order to manifest union with your twin flame and, and when, when we say like let it go and we're going to tell you what that thing is here here in just a second but when we say let it go it doesn't mean that you have to be some perfectly ascended master in order to come into union and harmonious union with your twin flame it just means that you have to be willing to make the choice to let this thing go to in order it, yeah. there we go to mm -hmm. work on it yeah mm -hmm. And so what is that thing, Adam? Fear. It's fear. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's fear is, is what fuels separation. And it can be fear of, it can stem or manifest from many different things. Maybe fear of feeling not worthy, fear that you'll be rejected, um, fear of divine love. Oh, my hair, there we go. <laughs> fear of hair in your mouth, no. <laughs> Yeah, that was corny. Okay, so fear of, yeah, maybe if you can share some more. Well, that you're not going to make it, that you're not going to have it in this lifetime, or you have to settle, or they're just going to go off and marry that other person, or, you know, which might happen, but still you got power, because, you know. But why would that happen? Why would they go off and marry someone else? But because there's separation. Right. And blocks to me, too. Mm -hmm. Fear. Yeah, and it, it fear, it, it blinds you, right? Mm -hmm. And so if you are experiencing a situation where your twin flame has gotten married or they're dating someone, someone else, it's because they have fear too. Mm -hmm. And so when you are fearful, you are clouded and you can't see the truth. And so they're not able to see that um, clearly that you're their divine lover, mm -hmm. just as like, in you know somewhere in you you're fearful and so you're rejecting that divine love and even if it's not on the surface if you're experiencing separation well it's indicating that there's there's um beliefs of separation within you and that can only only ever stem from fear or you know control things of that nature mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. So don't do that well <laughs> how do, how do you heal fear though yeah, you first you gotta make the choice to heal, right? Mm -hmm. And then we can utilize the mirror exercise and mm -hmm. anything that comes up for you that you're fearful of, and uh, four steps, right? And uh, go until you feel peaceful. Yeah, the mirror exercise basically it helps you identify the root of why you're experiencing the separation or the fear or the pain or the discomfort. It helps you pinpoint it at the root so that you can pull it out just like just as if you stepped on a thorn mm -hmm. you know if you're walking around outside and you step on a thorn you know exactly where to go to pull that thorn out of your foot and you're going to pull it out and throw it you know toss it to the side and you're going to keep moving mm -hmm. and so that's the same with the mirror exercises you identify the thorn in your consciousness and you pull it out mm -hmm. and you continue to move to move forward and as you continue applying this um, to heal separation, the momentum picks up and you manifest your, your twin flame union and into um, harmonious union. And it's a very simple, straightforward process. And if you would like help with healing separation from your twin flame, you know, we're Twin Flames Universe coaches and we're happy to help you do that. Yeah, it takes, um, let me get this situated. It takes a village to raise a harmonious twin flame union. And so you're not created to do it alone. You have massive amount of support available to you. You just got to 
claim it for yourself. Mm -hmm. And that also brings me to one other point is, um, you know, I often like see and hear people wanting to give up on their twin flame journey. And the only reason that happens is when you feel like you don't have the right tools or you're resistant to healing, right? If you're resistant to like looking within at what your twin flame is showing you or just doing self-reflection on what's causing the separation in the first place, um, you're not going to want to continue on the journey, but there's actually nowhere else to go. You know, your twin flame is your divine lover. And mm -hmm. so, you know, that's the person you're supposed to be with. You're meant to be with. And why not just move forward? It's kind of bugs. <laughs> why not just move forward into what your heart desires and love yourself through you know, the discomfort mm -hmm. and it does get easier as you love yourself. Oh, camera just said five, five, five. See, yeah, it's confirmation. It changes. Yeah, mm -hmm. it does get easier and it does get, um, you cultivate that harmony and that peace within yourself. And so don't give up on yourself, you know, go all in. Also fear erases faith, but also faith erases fear. Mm -hmm. So, it's, you know, Keep that in mind there we go yeah. yeah so choose to let go of fear and choose and claim your faith faith is mm -hmm. your fortune and faith is what's gonna sh see you through if you believe your will will receive yeah I like that if you believe you will receive it's law, <laughs> it's law. yeah do you have any other insights or um, any any other things about fear well it basically just erases everything you know the faith you do have the mm -hmm. but if you have a desire you will have it utilize yeah. the laws of the universe mm -hmm. law of assumption law of attraction can't go wrong exactly mm -hmm. everyone has heard about the law of attraction mm -hmm. and so like attracts like and if mm -hmm. you're you know holding fear or separation beliefs of, of separation mm -hmm. within your consciousness that's going to be your outer experience but when you mm -hmm. resolve that within and you start feeling and believing in union Union is what you're going to experience in your reality. So that should empower you to create the life that you desire. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have all the power you need. All right. Mm -hmm. I think we're complete here. Yeah. All right. So thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video.